Assalamu alaikum. Um, just prayed uh, Tarawi and I uh, wanted to share uh, for this week's um, post um, how Molana um, and his advice really, um, subhanAllah, changed my, helped my finances and really helped my life at the time. So this was, um, what was about five, six years ago. And um, I was working in a Muslim school, had a low, you know, low salary. Um, and I, I, I wasn't like quite in debt, but I, had to, I used to have to kind of borrow from my parents and things like that. And, um, you know, I was struggling financially. And um, in, in Leicester, where I live, you have lots of like Maulana's, mashallah. And um, I used to kind of study with some, study Arabic. And I noticed that, you know, mashallah, they always seem to be doing all right, seem to be doing well. You know, even though they had low paid jobs, they would, you know, they'd have their own house or they'd be, they seem to get on and, you know, go hajjumra every year and things like that. So I asked one of my teachers, I asked him, you know, he's my Arabic teacher. And I told him about my problems and it's quite tough, you know, um, uh, you know, in the low income and, you know, trying to, uh, you know, get by and well, what did, you know, what did he recommend? And uh, it was at the end of a lesson and he just said to me quietly, he said, you know, you could try reading uh, Surah Al-Waqiyah every night. And, you know, I think we've all heard about it, right? Um, uh, Abdullah bin Masood al who uh, said that um, he heard the Prophet Wasallam say that whoever recites Surah Al-Waqiyah every night, poverty will never afflict him. Okay, so I knew about this, but I'd never really taken it seriously. And sometimes it takes like a Maulana, a pious person, someone to pass that knowledge on to you, and then you take it seriously. So from that night, I decided that, inshallah, I was going to try um, uh, to, to do this. And I'm only sharing this with you. It's not good to share your works. But, you know, with the inspiration that the Prophet Islam passed that on to Abdullah bin Mas'ud, who passed it on to the, you know, the, umma, you know, the ulama, heard this hadith. I heard it from an alim. Inshallah, I'm passing in this uh, practical knowledge of how it implemented and how it helped me in my life with the hope that, inshallah, someone listening to this uh, will be inspired and maybe you guys will do it and, inshallah, we'll all share in the reward. And so what I started doing, because one of the things is like you hear this, but how do you implement it? And so I had, um, alhamdulillah, I had a, a job as a kind of like madrasa teacher, Quran teacher, and through that I'd already memorized Surah Al-Waqiyah. And by the way, Surah Al-Waqiyah is very easy to memorize, right? And, I, and I'm someone who, I, do, I don't have a good memory. I haven't memorized a lot of Quran, you know, most of Juz Amma and then a few other the famous surahs. Um, it didn't take me that long to memorize. If you look at the very short surahs, it's very memorable. If you know a little bit of Arabic, it's very the Arabic's nice and easy as well for Surah Al-Waqiyah. Uh, it's all about uh, Jannah and Jahannam and, um, you know, it's, it's a very beautiful surah. Um, so it didn't take me long to memorize. And then what I did in my, you know, if you, uh, yeah, I used to just pray my Isha in my witr. I pray three rakats witr. And so I would just, you know, my two sunnas and my three witr, five rakats, I would just easily um, divide it up into that. And it just became a habit. And alhamdulillah to this day, I, 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 I more or less keep that up. And you know what? Subhanallah. That year I did it, I started doing it. I had tawfiq to save up. Um, with my job, I was running, I, was, I think I was uh, imam of a madrasa. Um, I was um, uh, just teaching in a Muslim school. I was tutoring part-time. And I managed to save up a year's worth of savings to live in Jordan and study Arabic. It's like one of my dreams for, for my life. And then after that, I came back and I, I was able to be an entrepreneur. Um, I was able to go to Kuwait and have a job with a good income. And alhamdulillah, I've not looked back and I've never had, I've never been in financial, financial difficulty since that time, Alhamdulillah, shukran, may Allah uh, keep keep me in that in that state. Um, so yeah, I just want to share that. That's how Molana's advice changed my life, uh, um, helped my finances, got me out of debt, uh, and 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 put me in a much stronger financial position. And uh, I, I believe the barakah of Surah Waqiyah um, to this day has always helped me, Alhamdulillah, and I hope it will help you too, Inshallah. Jazakallah khairan. Assalamu alaikum.